Oh, hey, how you doing, YouTubers? This is uh, Roger Grimes again, and welcome to G Vlog. All right, this you're watching the Grimes Factor, and this is G Vlog. If you haven't seen this before, so I just want to say a few things in this vlog today. One is I want to recognize subscribers. Thank you to you guys. I want to also talk about Memorial Day weekend and fishing trip we had. It's pretty good stuff, and I want to throw a little something for you at the end. Um, so the thing is, I want to start with the subscribers. I want to thank you guys for subscribing to this channel. I know we just reached 600 subscribers. I know that's not a lot compared to a lot of these channels. It's not even a lot compared to my other channel. My other channel has almost 8,000 subscribers, which is fine, but this is my baby channel. This is the one that's growing up. And I want to thank you guys for helping with that. We have a goal right now, and this channel is a thousand. I know, you know, a thousand is okay. It's, it's a good start. It's not where I want to be at, but I got to start small first, right? So 600 was my one goal. We hit it. Now a thousand is the next mark. When we hit that, I want to have another video talking about that. So without you guys, this channel wouldn't be here. You see this here? This is a uh, mission statement you know, for my studio. What does that have to do with anything with the videos? Well, one thing is I put karate videos out. And this is it. I'm going to read it real quick though. Our mission is to teach self-defense. Also to strengthen and develop self-confidence, character, and health awareness. We will dedicate to teach integrity and strengthening of the mind and body of our students and instructors so we can develop a strong community. Well, that's awesome here. You know, this here is so much stuff. I know we don't always, you know, all my stuff on the YouTube isn't going to be talking about self-defense and, you know, strengthening the uh, develop it. Can't even speak, guys. I'm so excited about this. But develop self-confidence, character, and health awareness. We don't always hit all those, but on the channel we do. Because I do have things that are helping you lift up. Leadership principles I put out there, which I only got a couple of views on. I put biblical principles and Bible study out there, which I only got a couple of views on. It's the silly stuff a lot of people hit and watch more. But the karate is done, done pretty good. I also got fitness videos out there, so that's good stuff. But my pastor says, uh, a leader, I mean, I'm going to get so fast here. <laughs> a leader without followers is just somebody taking a walk. I don't want to take a walk. So I want to thank you guys for just following this channel, watching this channel, and enjoying it. It's not here just to entertain you. That's part of the reason, but we're here also to lift you and build you. So I want to go with that said and say, I hope you guys had an awesome Memorial Day. I got a short story about mine. It was good. I wanted to go fishing in the morning. We did that. I uh, played a little cornhole. Then I had a cookout, played basketball with my son. It was awesome. Spent time with my wife. Good time. But here's a story I thought was kind of humorous. I wanted to get up at 4 in the morning. Yeah, to go fishing. 4 in the morning, early. We go to Rocky River, which is here in Ohio. Cleveland area, northeastern Ohio. And we went to go fishing there. I didn't wake up to 5. I woke up at 2. I bumped the alarm reaching for water. Here I went and changed it to alarm 2. So it never went off, but I did wake up at 5. So it wasn't like the whole morning was gone. So now we get out there at 5 o'clock in the morning. I call my brother-in-law. Okay, I'm on my way. I get there. I call him, let him know I'm here so I don't go pounding rattling on the door so early in the morning. He goes, okay, it's open. Come on in. So I locked my keys in the truck. How did I do that? I just wanted to go fishing. <laughs> I didn't want to call a locksmith or anything. In Cleveland, I think they stopped, uh, the police officers, I think they stopped opening cars for people. I think they stopped doing that. But I'm like, okay, I used to work at a locksmith. He taught me how to get in there with a coat hanger too if I needed to. 
So, all right, and they taught me how to do that with my truck. So, all right, let's do that. See if my brother in law has that. We cannot find a metal coat hanger anywhere anymore. Think about it. How hard is it to get that? So, we're looking in the garage. Finally found a skewer for cooking on the grill. One of those, a shish kebab, you know. So, I, it was a flattened one. He said, yeah, you could use that. You, as I had to bend it, he said, okay. So I bent it up, got in the truck, saved the day with that. It was awesome, got the keys out, we got to go fishing. It rained about six hours before we went. So then we're out there fishing, and the river's a little high, catching a whole bunch of seaweed. <laughs> Tons of seaweed. Couldn't get any fish. I couldn't even get a bite. My brother in law catch fish here and there. I usually out fish him. This time I did. I actually caught one fish. But he's fishing, catching, you know, he got about six. It wasn't a lot, but I'm laughing out of nowhere. He's like, what are you laughing at? Does he caught a little fish? I say, oh, you got a kitten fish. He looked at me like I was crazy. I know some of you guys are like, what's a kitten fish? It says, baby catfish, duh. Come on, guys. <laughs> but no, I was laughing about that, playing country music. All right, he was playing them. Listen, I'm okay with country music. It's not my favorite music, but I like it too. So, but I'm replacing the words of the song. You know, I kind of changed it to like, my brother-in-law and I sitting around fishing, catching out the cat fit or kitten fish. I changed it. I mean, catching the kitten fish. All right, you don't want to hear me really sing, guys. I'm I'm terrible. But that was kind of the lines of it. It was pretty funny, so I'm laughing. Then I start laughing again. He goes, is he caught another fish? I'm laughing. He goes, quit laughing at me. I, I said, I'm just laughing because for one thing is, he don't want to touch the fish. So he's got the glove on every time. And he don't even want to really touch it with that. So I'm laughing about that. But here's the funny thing. I've never seen this all my years of fishing. He caught both hooks. We fished for two hooks. Both hooks in the mouth of that fish. Pretty funny. But the uh, thing is, you guys, you, what do you mean you haven't subscribed yet? Alright, if you haven't subscribed yet, I don't know what you're waiting for. Come on, subscribe. A thousand is subscribers is what we're looking for. We also, I came across a scripture this week and it was, I'm not even going to tell you where it was, but I'm going to tell you it is. Because I want you guys to comment underneath and let me know where it is. Let you talk amongst, amongst each other. But it was trust in the Lord with all your heart. And do not lean on your own understanding. With that said, I want to say God bless you. And subscribe. Subscribe.